this video we're going to show how you can add new views to your application. Since we have a view-based application, I'll close this other project here. There we go. So my views, this is the project that we were working with before. I have a default package and a views package. Default is my main loader that loads all the views. And the views package is where I'm going to have all of my pages. So inside the views folder we want to create a brand new view here well same way we created a project we go up to the file new menu instead of saying I want to create a new mobile project I'm going to create a new MXML component if I click on that oh, I will come back here and make sure I've got my project selected there we go file new MXML component there we are. Now, I'm going to be creating inside of my views source, so the my views project source folder, inside the views package. So I'm going to put that inside here, inside views. I'm going to create a view called two. And none for the layout. We'll come back to layout in a moment, but based on the view component. This is like in Flash professional when we were creating classes that extended movie clip class we are extending the spark components view class so I'll click new and there it is so inside views I have a new page called two here it is two dot mxml title is two title is home view on the first one title is two on the second one and if we run this project, there we go. This Hello World home view, that is my default one. If I come back here and I say Hello World in the title, when I run this, my default view will show up with this title. There it is, Hello World. There's the text label, Hello World, and this is the title. Okay, now to navigate from one to the next, we can come in here and create a script component. There we go. If I added a button onto this view and I add a click attribute, I can call a function that I put up inside of the script tag here or I can just simply write out the script that I would have put inside the function. So Navigator, this is my project basically that's the my views object this view navigator I'm talking about that thing so it's my app navigator dot push view this is the function that I'm going to call, and I want to go to the page called 2.mxml. Now I can't just write 2.mxml. 2 exists inside of views. So inside the package views, and we can see the code complete comes up, there's the page I want. 2. That's the one I want to go to. So I'm just going to wrap it up there. That's going to be the end of this. And if I run my project now, there it is. So I haven't put a label on the button or anything. Click on it. I'm now on page two. If I wanted to add a label to this button so I could see something, see the text. There it is. Click on it. it takes me to page two. So there we have it. We have a view based application whose root tag is view navigator application and it has two views inside of it. There we go. And on the click attribute we're adding a little bit of script to say navigator push view and this is the name of the view that we want to load into the view app application.